incline dumbbell skull crushers. Um, you know, same thought process as behind the bicep training. This thought process here, we went from training in a shortened position to overhead lengthened position. Um, wide dumbbells, um, it's open chain, you have to stabilize it more and that allows the, uh, you know, take a more natural joint path, if you will. Um, you know, a lot of people who have bad elbows are from just training exercises that don't fit them well for months on end and it ends up causing issues because it's so out of alignment. So, um, you know, dumbbells A, give you a great alignment and B, give you the opportunity to train with a neutral hand position, which is gonna give you maximum activation of the long head of your tricep, which is what we're after in the position we're training from. So, uh, show you what it looks like. One thing to keep in mind with these is um, as you progress your ability to do them, the load will get pretty heavy. Um, shoot for 80s from a top set today. Um, you very much so need to come correct with your shoulders and scapula. You need to have everything locked down like you're pressing. Like you'll see me get into position, it looks like I'm about to press before I do my first, uh, first rep of the skull crusher. So, all stuff to keep in mind.